What's up, everybody? It's Mr. You Know Who. And today, guys, I'm bringing you a quick video showcasing the cheats for Dragon Quest Builder 2. So, again, I just got the game. I played for a few hours, and I wanted to show you what you can do with the cheats as far as using the save wizard. So, there's a couple of cheats available that you should actually look into to make your life easier when playing this game. You do have max health, max defense, max strength, as well as max gratitude, or items, and max items. So I've been playing it for a few hours, and I only use two cheats. That's max strength, max items. I didn't even want to go with two ham in the game and use every cheat because it's going to ruin the experience. But as you guys can see in the background, as far as I got in the game, I did pretty much decent so far. I have a lot of seeds, a lot of blocks to work with, and they're pretty much maxed out. But I want to showcase to you guys the all item cheat and just recommend for you guys to be very careful using that cheat. So as you guys can see, I just have the basic stuff in my bag and they're all maxed out. To me, it didn't make any sense to use the max health when I could just have certain items that give me back health and max those out. So I want to have a little fun with the game. But I'm going to show you guys right now. I'm going to go kill a couple of enemies and showcase that my strength is really high for my level. But as you guys can see from my workstation, I got the basic stuff. Nothing crazy. I'm going to pick up some more stuff and make a better save. I just want to show you what the actual cheats can do. And, you know, it's working and it's up to date. So when you use the all item and max item at the same time, be very careful when you use that. It will replace everything inside your bag and you won't be able to get it back. So I learned that when I actually did it the first time and I was like, I had to revert back to my original save because I really didn't want to have all the items ahead of me doing the actual mission. I don't know if it's going to mess up the game, but it wasn't fun having every item in the game available to me, or I would say most items available to me in the game early prior to actually doing the mission. So as you guys can see right now, I'm going to hit a couple of enemies and I'm at level five, but my strength is really high, which again, I rather do that but not go too crazy on the health. Because like I said, I got items that will rejuvenate my life. So I'm not worrying about my life going down. But I'm going to switch over to the other save and show you guys all items or most items with maxed items. So just bear with me for a few seconds while I switch over. So, as you guys can see right now, I have all items and max items at the same time. And as you can see, I have a good amount of items before I even completed any of those missions. So, like I said to you guys before, I would not recommend for you guys to do this because it replaces all your previous items in your bag. Now, this is just a save that I would actually play around with, but I wouldn't use this as my main save only because I don't know the effect in the long run. So, you can see in the background, I have a lot of items maxed out before I even got them. Now, as far as my stats, they are the same, just max strength. I don't need max defense or max health because, again, I want to enjoy the game. But I just wanted to tell you guys this ahead of time before you actually try to use both of these cheats at the same time. I also recommend for you guys to make a backup of your save. And like I said before, if you're going to apply the cheats to your save, it has to be on the auto save. If you don't have an auto save, you can't apply the cheats. I did not try it on my regular save. Because the directions on save was just set to use the auto save. So don't get intimidated when you see step one through five auto save. 
just use the auto save and then once it's done you can apply the cheats you may have to reach a certain point in the game to have the game auto save for you so don't worry but that's pretty much it as far as this video is concerned I'm coming out with another video shortly I am playing the Modern Warfare beta and I'm gonna give my impression on what I think about that very soon but just sit back relax and enjoy this game once again, I thank you guys for supporting my channel and watching my videos, and I will get up with you guys later. Peace.